write the value of limit extends to a x into f of a minus a into f of x upon x minus a so let us simplify this limit extends to a x into f of a let us add and subtract with a times of f of a and then minus a times of f of x divided with x minus a so which can also be written limit extends to a so we can take f of a common and we can write x minus a and here we can take minus a common and we can write f of x minus f of a upon x minus a so which can be written as limit extends to a f of a into x minus a upon x minus a minus a times of f of x minus f of a upon x minus a by algebra of limits we can take separately limits for and here we can cancel this x minus a in the numerator and denominator and we can write limit extends to a f of a minus limit extends to a a into f of x minus f of a divided by x minus a so here f of a is an independent of x so which is a constant so we can write f of a minus and here we can write by using algebra of limits we can take a separately outside a into limit extends to a f of x minus f of c upon x minus a so which implies that which is equal to f of a minus a into since we know that f is differentiable at a point x is equal to a if limit extends to or at a point x is equal to c limit extends to c well here x is a sorry f of x minus f of c upon x minus c is given by f dash of c so we can write a into here extends to a f of x minus f of a divided by x minus a from the definition of differentiability we can write f dash of a so that we can give the answer as f of a minus a into f dash of a